So in this video I'm gonna make this nice quiche with coal fish or seta. I heat the oven for on 150 degrees. There's the fish about a kilo frozen and I cut it in pieces to be bacon. But first I want to get rid of all the moist all the liquid in the fish because otherwise the quiche gets too moisty. That's not good. So then I have this dough with uh, leafy uh, leafy dough that it's not a very good product here in Germany. In Holland we have much better. Uh, at the end of the video I will show you how to make dough yourself which is much better. Um, so this uh, form with the dough goes for 15 minutes in the oven and here I bake the Pore with the fish and that is the filling of the quiche and on that filling there comes a, let's call it a sauce with whipped cream, four eggs, nice gouda cheese out of my home country, some salt, nutmeg and pepper and that we all make a nice mixture of it and that will put on the quiche at last I will show you that so here the dough is ready after 15 minutes you can see it's not so very successful but uh, anyway we can still make a nice quiche of it then put the fish mixture in there then put some mozzarella cheese on it that's a nice extra in this quiche you can play with quiches as you want, as you like, fill them with all kinds of stuff. And then my mixture is going on that. And uh, since I like melted cheese a lot, I put some more cheese on top. Yummy. So that looks already very good. We put the oven from 150 to 180 degrees Celsius and we put it first a little bit lower in the oven so the bottom is cooking, baking very well and after 30 minutes I'll put it in the middle of the oven and then the whole quiche should be well heated and well done. 30 minutes. So an hour in total. And then we take a wooden stick. Oh, it's looking already very nice. And if the stick is clear, then the quiche should be ready. And how ready it is. Mm. Perfect. Yeah. So here it looks from the inside. A little mm. bit moist still, but it's not a problem. And uh, I can tell you that is a very, very nice quiche. You can also make it with bacon and it tastes, tastes very good. You might have seen that the dough with the puff pastry was not perfect, so now I'm making myself a dough. 250 grams of flour, 125 grams of butter in small pieces. Then we put one egg in there, one little spoon of salt and one little teaspoon of cold water no more so and then we make it not too smooth the whole dough because there should still be some air inside and then we put foil over it plastic and we let it rest for one hour then it's time to roll the dough and put it in the form and it already is a lot better than with the puff pastry so and it's easy as well as you have seen and then we make little holes in there with a fork as with the puff pastry and then we put it in the oven for 15 minutes and that's looking good it's already well 
baked and now we make a quiche with a mushroom chicken porridge porre um, mixture and again the mixture with the cooking cream and egg and cheese is again the same as with in every quiche we put it in the oven for one hour 180 degrees and after an hour it looks like this a little bit dark it's not so moisty as the previous one and the dough was very good so good luck enjoy have a good meal and see you in the next do wild youtube bye bye